Hello, I'm JJ Davis, and welcome to our latest edition of the Bluff Sports Zone. Now, of course, I have to give some love to two of my guys. They're a big part of the BSC Funhouse. In fact, they represent the present and the future. Same deal up in the Dome. Two of the best Class A football teams in the state go toe-to-toe -to -toe in a classic Final Four showdown. Now, one has a ton of seniors, and the other does not. Undefeated St. Albert goes for the gold against the Golden Bears. The face of the Falcons, Luke Waters and St. Albert making its 13th appearance in the Final Four, home in the Dome against unbeaten Bishop Garrigan. First possession, Golden Bears fourth and six from the SA-20. Quarterback Brad Capesius puts it up for Joel Vask inside the five. Number five sneaks it in, and the Bishops on the board eight to zip. The Falcons right back. Waters, who finishes 7 of 19, 121 yards, hits Tyler Blaha. But the junior quarterback fumbles it away a few plays later. The Golden Bears make it 14-0 in the second quarter. Capesius to Gibson Bear. And number one later scores from four yards out, 14 to zip Garrigan. But St. Albert punches it in late in the half. Luke Waters, a human battering ram, 14-yard touchdown run, under three minutes left. Waters to Blaha. The junior, four catches, 107 yards. 23 seconds to go, Rodrigo Barajas drills a 30-yard field goal, and the Falcons head into the half down 14-10. Under five minutes left third quarter, Bishop Garrigan quarterback Brad Capesius rolls one way and throws the other. 19 yards to Joel Vask, 20 to 10 Golden Bears. But St. Albert fights right back. Luke Waters, 24 carries, 147 yards, bowls him over from 28 out, and it's 2017. The mean green machine keeps coming. Fourth quarter, the Bishop marches 80 yards, 14 plays, converts twice on fourth down. Gibson Bear then does the honors. The final six yards, 26-17, Bishop Garrigan. The Falcons fly right back. Barajas, a 45-yard field goal, 26-20, under three minutes left. St. Albert, an onside kick, and Andrew Hannafin recovers. The Falcons still alive. SA fourth and one from the Garrigan 37. Waters, 10 yards in the first down. 46 seconds to go. St. Albert fourth and 20 from the 36. Incomplete, and Bishop Garrigan holds off a gritty bunch of Falcons, 26 to 20. It's a heck of a football game between two really, really good teams. You know, it came down at the very end, and I, I truly thought we were going to pull it out, and we just didn't quite have enough at the very end. Cover that onside kick. I'm thinking, amen. Yeah, well, I've going through our head, we're, we're going to win, we're going to go down, going to make some plays, going to score, we're going to take the game, we're going to play next Friday, but didn't go our way. Almost undescribable. It's just so much work poured into one season just to have it fall down to one play. It's just a hard feeling to explain. It hurts pretty bad, but I mean, if you look back to it, you know, I had a little tears in my eyes, but... It was a good season, you know, we wanted to finish at the Dome, and here we are, you know. It's a long four and a half hours home, but, uh, you know, we'll get back together, we'll gather, we'll, we'll appreciate what our five seniors did for us and move back in the weight room on Monday. The Falcons lose just one starter on offense, two on defense. So if you're thinking what I'm thinking, next season can't come too soon enough for St. Albert.